Hi everyone, very good morning. Our talk today, our topic is Apache JMeter scripting challenge 4. Okay, currently this series is currently running. Okay, one by one scripting challenge I will provide it. Okay, today our uh, the main discussion Apache JMeter scripting challenge 4. Okay, first one scenario. Okay, the scenario is okay. The scenario is I need to print the values in log. Okay, you need to print the values in log. JMeter log you need to print and get the thread number in log values and get the thread number in log values. Means which website URL is send the request to the server, you need to print the log values. Actually, I am already provided in real time scenario. I am already provided the uh, parameterized one file at this ESP data set config. Whenever the user HTTP request also parameterized within the dollar, open and close the flower brackets, place I parameterized. Whenever the test is based on the load will be executed, right? Uh, it's a sequentially one by one uh, the URL in parameterized file. I am already provided the uh, bulk of URLs. One by one will hit it to the server and get the response. But main our intention, I need to print to the in JMeter logs whatever URL will hit it to the server, right? The URL and what is the thread number? Thread means which user you need to execute it. There are so many multiple thread groups and multiple users based on the distributed load. You will execute it, right? You don't know which one is failed and which URL you need to fail. That reason, I need to print the one is URL, second one is thread number. Both is the pass and fail, both you need to display. Okay. That way you can easily you can identify which user and uh, which URL is not working. Okay, maybe it's not working means uh, whenever you try to execute it in manually, it's working. But whenever you need to run it through load based on the your achieve your objective based, maybe it's not working right. That issues everything development team will be take care, not for your end. But you need to test it and you need to prove that one it's failed. Okay, what type of issues you are facing without any script. And uh, without any script and performance testing point of without any issues, right? Yeah, you can report it to development team. That purpose, okay? The main intention in single word, you need to print the in parameterization file. What are the request will be send it to the server and what is the thread number? URL and thread number both you need to display to the in JMeter log, okay? That is the main intention in scenario, okay? Now moving to solution, create the tree structure. First test plan, thread group, bean shell sampler, HTTP request, view results tree. Okay. This is currently I am showing to the demo purpose. I am adding this tree structure. In real time, right, you need to add the uh, you need to add the CSV dataset config file also. Okay. Whenever you need to run the multiple URLs, right? Through parameterization file, that reason you need to add this CSV dataset config file. But our demo it's not required that one, just one single user and a single website only, right? I'm hitting that reason I'm directly creating. Okay, this structure after uh, moving to the main uh, in HTTP request, right? In HTTP request, whenever you're creating the URLs parameterization, right? In URL parameterization, you already parameterized it uh, with the uh, dollar sign. Okay, you already parameter the name is link link means it's a URL link only a short name will provide a link after the code in bean shell sampler you need to write the following code first of all what is the name you provided the in parameterization same name only you need to declare where link will be given means the variable is declared to the link first it's initiated after where's dot it's the where's is the in jmeter functions where's dot put open you can give into the the variable name is link and you can see guys comma double quotations www.google.com i am directly will given okay in demo point of view 
uh, in real time, right? You need to add this place CSV that's a config file and the same dollar open and close, right? This file name, same part, um, the name only you need to pass it this place. That is sufficient. Okay. There is no more difference. Just dollar open and close link, right? The same only you need to plus pass to the instead of www.google.com. This one will uh, connect to the this is the parameterized file based on your condition sequential right based on user load which one will be picked it will be passed this one okay that is the way will be work in real time for our of um, current demo scenario right directly I will pass this place only okay no need to connect this one that one okay after now you need to print right first of all variable is declared and you already mentioned link is there. This is the specific website. Okay. Now you need to print it to the in your log. You will return where x is equal to where start get. Where start get means it, it will give a link. Link means the link will call it as google.com. Okay. The google.com it's available. It's directly this place only available, right? Means the link is connected to link uh, the first one where dot put what is the name you provided in variable link you already provided the site url the site url will pass it to the link the link only you will come to this place the link place is available www.google.com it's available in log what you need to print right log dot info value of x is plus x will be given x means plus x means in in your output will be printed value of x is plus x right this one will www.google.com the final output value of x is www.google.com will be printed after now url target is completed now thread number where the name will be given y where y equal to ctx it's a citrix okay you can call it as j meter variables ctx dot get thread bracket daughter get thread name bracket you can provide it right this one will call it as thread number and one important points t thread means t thread means t is a capital letter okay and you can see thread name t and n is both are capital letters after log dot info you can give the thread name is plus y y means this entirely thread number and output how we need to get right Thread name is thread number is single user right first thread iPhone first user thread name is thread number one iPhone one that is the output you getting okay our main target you need to print to the URL right first one will be printed URL this one second one will print it thread number this one will be printed okay this is the way you need to work you need to add the Bayesian sampler and you need to parameterize. In real time scenario, just this one you need to place instead of this one and add the uh, entry structure CSV that's a config file and you can provide the path. Whatever path you provided, right? That variable name you need to provide the link that is sufficient. Okay. This is the Bayesian sampler. This code you need to add it, guys. That's all. You able to achieve your scenario and you can see. Uh, yeah, this one also same only whatever code will be pasted in JMeter, right? That one only I, I will paste it same. JMeter, bean shell, sampler. Okay. Okay, now you need to go to JMeter and I will show you. Okay. Same tree structure guys, nothing will be changed. Test plan, just a minute, it's not responding. Test plan, thread group, it's a single users only. HTTP request. You can see HTTPS. I will give in Google.com. I am already parameter within the dollar sign, dollar open and close link. I will provide it. Okay, it's already parameterized, right? In Bayesian sampler, it's already available. Same link will be declared, and the put the link. The www.google.com will pass to the in link place. Same link only you can give into the in X output. It's very simple. Declare the variable, the google.com URL will pass it to the link. The link will come to this place and you can directly will print it. Value of x is URL. 
in success right the success and failure everything will be displayed to the in your request only whenever request is failed you can find out to the thread number the thread number you can go to the log you can check to the uh, in which thread number which url is failed you can capture that one easily and this one will provide the thread number the code is same nothing will be changed okay and uh, now you need to execute this is that view results tree and view result table okay just you need to run and you can see just a minute it's not responding yeah you can see hdb request 200 it's pass and bean shell sampler also 200 both it's pass okay nothing will fail now where you need to find your output right okay uh, you can see guys this is the place bean shell test element value of x is www.google.com okay value of you can see this is the output guys value of x is www.google.com second one thread name is thread group one bar one one bar one means first one is the thread group second one is the thread thread group thread means user first thread uh, first thread group first user that is the meaning okay this is the way the results will be this is simple one user right it will display it this way whenever you run the 100 user load right there are so many urls and uh, thread numbers will be moving up okay that time you need to find out the difficult that reason only will create it this way you can find out the in view results tree which request is failed means in thread number you will find out right automatically you can come to thread number and url you can easily find out and you can report them okay that's all guys uh, this scenario now you understand right it's a very simple code it's a not a complex one very very simple one but whenever you need to coming to the scenarios this type of one right you need to implementing is uh, some little bit complicated okay but whenever you need to learn to the uh, the methods functions how you need to use uh, that everything you can practice is ma multiple scenarios you can practice it right whenever you come to the any uh, scenarios your end okay you can easily you can implement that purpose i am explaining this all the challenges and uh, another thing in interview purpose also okay whenever interview will ask like you can explain this step by step that is very important he will ask something and you told something okay that is not a matter right Interview is very important. Without cracking any interview, you are not able to do, right? Client interviews is different. Okay, client interviews is asking what you are doing, what is what. That is done. That is totally different case, guys. It's not take uh, 30 minutes also is not taken, client interviews. Okay, uh, whenever you join the company after any client interview will be taken, right? That is totally different case. You are in outside of the company now. You are trying to the job, right? That is a um, it's a freshers or one or two years experience or very high experienced people also. The main problem whenever people is in outside, whenever you need to take into the interview, right? That time all the things will be asked. Okay, that that time you need to satisfy to the interviewer. Okay, the person is able to confident the candidate is able to do right. That time only is able to select it okay first of all he will ask the scripting challenge right first of all you need to explain to the scenario what type of scenario you are facing or what type of requirement you will get it scenario or requirement both are same okay based on your scenario or requirement you can explain to the step by step what type of scenario you will get it okay once you will get clearly you can explain to the scenario after how you need to create the tree structure which one is the parent which one is the child how we need to create the chains and sub chains everything okay step by step you need to explain after uh, what are the things you parameterize also you need to explain that is also very important 
after this is the main important one bean shell sampler whenever you create the bean shell sampler right okay just a minute it's a Okay, whenever uh, you told to the bean shell sampler, right, you need to explain to this code also. Okay, explain in the code means directly what type of variables you given. Okay, the variables how you need to pass that one, how do you need to print it to the in URL on the same time thread number both, how you need to print it to the your log and how you need to complete it your scenario. Okay, and the another important thing. What type of issues you are facing whenever uh, you need to create this type of one, right? Uh, that type of questions also somebody will ask. Okay, you need to give in to the thread place T is the capital, thread name place T and N is the capital letters. Okay, you can see where is different, where is different. Okay, you need to explain that is the variable, this is the function related. And log.info you will display to the in output in log place okay this all the things one by one you need to explain and you need to satisfy to the interview the specific your scripting challenge point of view somebody will ask one or two questions but some people specifically will ask okay at the same time you can explain this all the things right uh, he will ask you need to write the code and you can explain also okay that is also be ready that is only you can practice the code two three times and you can practice the inward tool also okay that is also very important that time you can what type of syntax errors you will get it how you need to debug everything also you need to explain that is the way uh, you can satisfy to the interview and moving forward you can proceed it okay yeah that's all guys this video most of the things i covered okay nothing else this is very very simple script guys it's not writing any complex one it's very simple you can you also you can write just five minutes you can understand your own self you can your own way your own style you can write it okay yeah that's all guys today this video is completed and my request uh, you like this video please subscribe my channel i will provide the more videos on same channel okay yeah, that's all guys. I will connect to the another scripting challenge. I will provide my latest video after next day. Thanks everyone. Bye.